Welcome back to Tales of Monkey Island, Rise of the Pirate God. We're back with our ephemeral ghostly pal, Guy Wars Threepwood. We're on a raft with Winslow and a hypnotized monkey. Um, monkey Island's weird. So let's go back down here. Last episode we had uh, uh, Winslow here write a love note to Anemone, his mer-girl girlfriend. Uh, it, it's weird. Alright, so we've got... Oh, Winslow's note is right here next to the fishnet we can't pick up. So, hey, Anemone, come out here and get your note. I can't pick it up for you. I can't pick up nothing. Are you still in there, and then in the meat? <laughs> oh, he as long as name. my truck is still alive, I'll be in here. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Um, Winslow dropped a note. Anemone, Winslow dropped a note down to you. It's sitting right over there. Mi amore. There you go. Somehow the ink has survived. Oh, did you knock it off? No. But you did perturb it's no, floating. <laughs> I'll be back later. Be careful. Always am. I mean, I'm a pirate as much as a pirate can be careful. So now it looks like it's going back and Ooh. forth more wildly. So I think if I time walking away right. Boom! There we go. Okay. Clam bubbles. Lock it saved. Alright, so now let's go back up there and get Winslow to fish that guy out of the I ocean. Say. Oh, you already did. Captain Greenwood! My beloved has sent me a sign. I must prepare myself for a reunion. Yeah, with scuba gear. Mizzens. I haven't smelled this rotten since languishing in my own filth while doing my time in the hold of Captain Liverbottom's traitor skin. On top of your clothes. That's that? not how deodorant, deodorant works. Deodorant, Captain. Bought from the apothecary. N and wood tick, I believe. Oh, wood tick. Winslow, the locket isn't a sign from Anemone. She loved your poem, but I sent that locket up here. I can't touch it, but it's the thing that's going to reunite my ghost with my body. Oh, most important thing. Most? Well, I'll hang it here, as if it were our map. Oh, jeez. Remember our map, sir? How could I forget? Let this locket lead you back to your body. Oh. The way our map has led us to adventure. Yeah, sure. Wax philosophical on that. All right, so we have a picture of our ghost self. And we can put it in here. And now it goes to our corpse, our body, our physical self. Transfers spirits to bodies based on which way that little arrow button is pointing. I can't press it though. But oh, I Winslow wouldn't mind helping. Winslow, you know Mr. the job. Winslow? Yes, sir. Press that button. Mr. Winslow, would you mind pushing the button on that locket for it's your It's like old the captain? map. Certainly, sir. So, I'm guessing my ghost is just standing there on the raft with a vacant 12-yard stare. What the heck? Ooh, I don't remember my body being this cold. Hey! Ah, great jumping jimmits! It's alive! Yeah! It ain't alive! It's some kind of voodoo zombie! Quick, chop its head off! What? Ooh, wait a second. Don't worry, Your Honor. A good womp in the choppers ought to take care of this one. Um, I'm sure we can talk this out. I'm sure we can talk this out. Ow. Ow! Are you alright, sir? I think I just had the spirit knocked out of me. Ah, uh, yes, that would explain the girlish scream, sir. Alright, so we should try that again. Mr. Winslow? Let's not get sir? punched in the face this time. Um... Press the button again. Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. Boop. I'm back. Back for another round, zombie boy. Um, I surrender because anything else is gonna be punched again. Terrific! Off to jail with you. What I do? You there? I'll be back shortly. I'm taking this body to the jail. Sure. The ladies come calling. I'll tell them that's where you went. Okay. Oh, great. I'm in jail. Again. Okay. Wads of gum in that one. Where's that? Isn't there a loose brick here somewhere? Oh, uh, what? Oh, peachy. Loose brick, here we go. Hey, somebody stashed something behind this loose brick. Hey, cool. It's a book? It's a diary. It's a diary. What's it say? Whose diary Dear is it? Diary. <gasps> well, it's Bug Eyes! Jail. 
Apparently, I misunderstood when the mer person I met asked if I needed a lift. I assumed that meant I could ride him all the way into town. Anyway, I'm hiding you for now in case they search me. I don't want anyone knowing my personal inner thoughts. Hmm. What else is in here? Dear Diary, I think that any moment now the manatees will start kissing. I hope I can slip out just as he slips the tongue. Ew. Ew. I think I've read enough. Okay, so now I think we have something on Bug Eye. So maybe we can get him to not punch us. Uh oh. My body is starting to feel all numb and tingly. I wonder if that's a bad sign. I wouldn't think it's a great sign. I think I think I'm gonna end up being disconnected from my body. Oh, there it goes. Hey, what happened? I don't know, sir. The locket sparked a couple of times, and before I could say sexy fish, you were back here. Uh, sexy fish? It's an expression, sir. Something I picked up while on my tour of the exotic Limbo Islands. You are very so well what traveled. What you're saying is the effects of the locket are temporary. That's that good, sir. That does appear to be the case, sir. Well, that's just great. Winslow? Mr. Winslow? Yes, sir. The button. Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. Hey, how'd my body get back here? We came to check on you and found it just laying around. We figured you were dead again, so we just put you back Something here. on the wall back there. But it looks like you're acting up again. Ready for another round, zombie boy? All right. Um, let's see if we can Bring go. it on, bug juice. Oh, he's just going to punch me. No, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so it's gotta be a different option. Yeah. Maybe I should try a different approach. Yeah. Can't touch anything, let alone no, press, press the button. Press the button. I forgot. Winslow. Mr. Winslow? Yes, sir. Press the button. Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. For another round, zombie boy. Uh, I'm sure we can talk this out. Uh, I'm sure we can talk this out. Nope, that's not gonna do it. And I don't have an option to like use anything. Like I can't like show him the diary. Mr. Winslow, <sighs> try this yes, again. Sir. Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. The only one left is I'm Gabber Streetwood Mighty Pirate. Yeah, I'm Guybrush Streetwood. This is the only one. I'm Guybrush Streetwood. I mean to kill you all. Nope. Okay, I must be missing something here. Ouch! Welcome back, sir. Well, let's go see what else we've got in the rips. Let's see if we can't get somewhere else. I think. It seems like there's probably rips in each of the areas, so... Alright, so let's go to the sword fight. That's the next one, I think. It's the first one we went to. What? Ew. Fool tree wood. What oh. have you done? Ah! Talking crabs! Why did you open the crossroads? With the barriers shattered, Lechuk is now beyond all control, plundering voodoo energy directly yes, well. from the spirit realm. Thanks to you, reality itself could unravel like a cheap rug. Um. What about you? Yeah, you kind of. What about you, Miss All Knowing, All Seeing, Voodoo Puppet Mistressy Person? Why didn't you warn me that LeChuck had nefarious plans for La Esponja Grande? I'm afraid LeChuck made fools of us all this time, Guybrush. But hope is not yet lost. Yeah, I kind of didn't trust well, him either. Didn't fool me. In fact, I'm already working on a plan to possess my body. So they can't zap me with root beer again when I go back. Yes, the voodoo root beer only affects spiritual manifestations in the physical realm. If you can manage to repossess your body, you may yet be able to use LeChuck's weapon against him. Um... Yeah, Sponge Grande? Sponge Grande? 
You must figure that out for yourself. Go now, find your body. Find a way for your spirit to possess it. But remember, rebinding a soul to a body is not as simple as taking you yourself have that. over. You're rebelling against the natural state of things, and the universe will push back. Once you have possessed your body, you'll have to find a more permanent way to bind it to your soul. I recommend Mix and Mojo brand Spirit Gum. Oh. It can create a powerful spiritual bond that will bring your restless spirit and body together in harmony. It's also delicious. It comes in lemon, cherry, and mutton flavors. I always have some with me. Can you give me some of that spirit gum? I cannot risk coming out of hiding to aid you, Guybrush. But I was chewing some when I was imprisoned back oh, in the gum. I may have left some back in the jail cell. Remember, spirit gum contains some ingredients from the spirit realm, so it retains some ghostly properties. Be careful with it. I must go now, Guybrush. It is too dangerous for me to let my true whereabouts be known. You kind of sound like a oh. coward. I hope this is just a phase she's going through. Okay. So there's another rip up here. So she, ne I need to get spirit gum, which is a hilarious play on words. Rip. Oh. Whoa. This whole jumping between realms thing is gonna take some getting used to. Hey you, pipe down. We're in the middle of a pirate wake here. A what? Oh, yep, that's me. This is a pretty disappointing wake. Yeah, well, LeChuck's killing spree may have hindered the turnout a bit. It's true. And why am I posed like that? It's zany. The customers love it. What? That's exactly the way I remember you. Now we should be able to talk Yo, to Bug Eye without. What do you want, Pipsqueak? How'd you get out so of the manatee? How did you get out of the manatee and end up on Flotsam? I don't want to talk about it. I bet I can guess. You slipped that on the tongue. Hmm. Perhaps you waited around until the mating ritual, made your way to the tongue, and escaped when the manatee went in for the kiss. Hey, who told you that? That's private information. And once free from the manatee, you... Wrote a mere person. Befriended a mer person who you ended up riding all the way to the shores of Flotsam. That's impossible! No one knows about that! Look I do. me! I'm Bug Eye. I like to get in on manatee makeout sessions and ride merfolk around. Are you mocking More dancing. Me, Okay, um, oh, what's he doing? Okay, I think I gotta copy his face. It's not hooded. Stinky? Yes, and then tweaking? Yup, okay. And then the face is meanie? I think so. Yeah. Arr, does it look like I'm mocking you? I'm Big Bad Bug Eye. I keep a girly diary. I wish I had hair so I could put it up in curls. Let's just see how that face looks with my fist mm, shoved in it. I'm a ghost. Oof. Oh, and you punched the judge. Good job. All right, that's enough. I think you need some time to calm down, lad. It's off to the drunk tank for you. And you, don't slime up the place while I'm gone. That was quick. I'll just leave him there until he cools off. So now I can get to the other prison cell if I come back, because he'll pretty much probably take me directly to jail. Go through here. He just keeps throwing darts at my corpse. Thanks a lot, buddy. I'm gonna be perforated when I get my body back. All right, back to the cro uh, to the uh, gateway. Because the gateway has the gates to Club 41, or to the Winslow ship, which gives you back to my body. Oh my gosh, being dead is complicated. Alright, run to the turnstile, pass Galeb, and let's come into here. Rip, rip. I tell you they're called rips, because RIP is rest in peace as well, which is. <sighs> this game. I like this game. 
All right, so I'm back with Winslow. Winslow, buddy, press the button. Now that bug eye can't punch me. Yes, um, press the button. Would you mind now I need to figure button? out how I'm gonna find the spirit gum because she said it reacts to magic or other world or the zombie powers I've got. So maybe I could just spit on it or something. I'm back. Hold your ground, or I'll take you down myself. Ghosts are one thing, but I really <laughs> hate zombies. Um, I surrender. I surrender. You do? Terrific! Off to jail with ya! No one else sees this otherworldly well, portal? We're neighbors! Shut your cheese hole, zombie boy. You're the reason I'm in here, mm, you know. No, you all punched right, him. Alright, alright, I'll keep it down. Alright, so here's all this waza chewed gum. Ooh, I still have my... This is the last remnant of my corporeal okay. self. I shouldn't monkey around with it. So, one of these... The stalactite of gum looks pretty fresh. Nope. Hmm. Dust, spit, and just a hint of lavender. Otherwise, it's completely tasteless. Ew. Okay. Mug? Free Guybrush Streetwood! Free Guybrush Streetwood! No new taxes! Down with porcelain! <laughs> Lay off the banging or I'm gonna shove that mug up your blowhole! Free Guybrush Streetwood! Free Guybrush Streetwood! Oh. This just isn't the same. Uh oh. I feel a depossession coming on. Hey, look at that! A gaping round hole in the wall! The voodoo lady must have escaped through this. Convenient! Ah, sweet lady freedom! Uh oh. Oh no! Welcome back, sir! You know, every time I pass out in the jail, they haul my Okay, so I had that cup in my hand. You think I should go back as a ghost and check on my body? Hmm. Yeah. Who knows what strange party favors they'll dress my body up in next. Thanks for the advice, Mr. Winslow. Certainly, sir. Best first mate ever. Alright, so let's go back to Club 41 as a ghost. See what more information... Because he said it'd be good to check up on my body. So I'm assuming he has a reason for that. All right, this is the one of the primary differences I find between LucasArts and Sierra Games. Is Sierra Games don't hold your hands. Um, LucasArts tends to give you very good hints, which I appreciate because I can get stuck on puzzles. King's Quest. That's also the reason King's Quest games take so much longer. It's a lot more hemming and hawing and um, uh, mm, uh, mm, I wonder type situations. Back to back to the bar. All right. Hi everyone, I'm back. Shh, I be trying to concentrate here. All right. Let's see. Oh, I've got my mug now. And he seems to be a poor shot. What's in these barrels? My body is perfectly positioned for another root beer shower. Root beer. Hey. Huh. Okay. Hi there. Captain Threepwood, as I live and breathe! And I don't. Don't rub it in. Nah. Boo, I'm a scary ghost. Ooh, I'm a scary ghost. Okay. Uh, let's just, we don't, doesn't really matter which one we do, I don't think. Yeah, uh, quit that! Excellent. Oh, scary. cool. You just screwed up my concentration. Good. And poured a perfect pint. That's amazing. You are the best bartender in history. In pirate history. No, in world history. Oh, uh, what else can I do? Blindfold. Oh, this is the blindfold they use when you first enter Club 41. That's the blindfold I wore back when I had my first bar fight here. Although, technically, it was my pox-infested hand that did most of the fighting. Ah, good old Lefty. I hope he's happy, wherever he is. <laughs> it's true, we do not know where good old Lefty is. Alright, so now we have root beer. Oh, there's a monkey here. It's Shock! Hey, it's Shock the monkey! Hey, you little guy! Huh. I wonder why his eyes are all funky. Oh, again. he's hypnotized too. He's the reason there's a rip. Okay. I bet nobody calls him the life of the party. Uh. Hey Alright, so let's go back and see if that root beer does anything with our body. Because I think. Maybe it's magical root beer? 
Alright, let's go back. Back to the gateway. Boop. All right, through here. It's a lot of walking around. All right, through here. And then Winslow presses the button. Today. There you go. Winslow? Button Mr. time. Winslow? Yes, sir. <coughs> Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. <laughs> okay. So I surrender. I'm back! Hold your ground or I'll take you down myself! Ghosts are one thing, but I really hate zombies! Uh, I surrender. I surrender! You do? Terrific! Off to jail with you! Alright, back in here with Bug Eye. Alright, so let's see if the root beer. Let's see how Spirit Gum reacts to a little root beer. Ooh, that brings back unpleasant memories. Yeah, I did just get zapped. Oh, that one's fizzing. Oh. Hey, now this is delicious and tingly. And hey, keep it down over there. Whoa. Now that is spirit gun. All right. All right, corpsey body. Let's go get that cutlass of Kaflu, save Elaine, and take down the Chuck once and for all. Hey, don't you leave me here. Come on, at least give me some gum. Sorry, but guy, okay. you kind of punched me a couple times. I don't forgive that easily. All right, so we have now escaped from jail. We are reunited with our zombie body. Yay. Um, I don't know if Elaine's gonna love my zombie body. Oh, oh, we're back. Ah, I'm back, LeChuck. Now that I have my root beer proof and only slightly rotting body again, I can touch anything I want. So get ready to be touched to death. Touched to death. Sharp, pointy death. Finally. Ouch! How beat you that stings? <laughs> Do you think I'm some kind of dolt? A little bit. Dolt? This sword now has enough demonic power in it to bring down a god. Did you think we'd let you get your mortal hands on it? Well, seriously, yeah. who uses the word dolt anymore? With just one swipe, that sword could completely obliterate your body. I do wish you hadn't made such a pest of yourself. I wanted you alive to see me marry Elaine. I've told you a million times, LeChuck. I'm already Till married. Till death do you part, Freepwood. And that hmm. part has already been taken care of. Elaine, my dear, please dispose of this irritating corpse. With pleasure. Elaine? Snookums? Um. This isn't great. Elaine, sweetie, stop! It's me! What? Winslow, my man! You, sir! I found the map! Mr. Winslow! Is that bug eye? How oh. dare you! I have a wedding ceremony to plan, a dress to pick out, a reception to arrange, and some bridesmaids to slaughter. I don't have time for this. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm more powerful now than I could have ever been as a lowly governor or a pitiful pirate. Stupid sponge. I like you better when you were smaller. Ooh. Can we make it small? smaller? Smaller. I've got to shrink that sponge. <laughs> this is marvelous. You really think you still have a chance? Go ahead. Give it your best shot. I'll even give you a head start. Just know this. There is nowhere you can go where I cannot find you. <laughs> oh. 
I get my physical body in the crossroads. Listen up, Sponge. It's time you lost some weight. I still have my Feast of the Senses spell in my body. I just need to find someone who can help me reverse it. Booty lady. Alright, well, let's check out the other... If there's any other rips. Because if there's one in the gateway and one in the melee, maybe there's one in the thieves' den and the um, treasure huntery place. Welcome back, friend. Mm -hmm. I don't trust you, man. Is there a rip here? Nope, no rip here. Surprising. Okay. Nothing to see here. Moving on. Let's go to the treasure huntery. I gotta go. Come back soon, friend. Uh -huh. Alright, treasure hunt. Oh, yep, there's a rip there. Wonder where this one goes. Um Hey buddy. Oh, I still have to catch those pyrite parrots of Petaluma. Okay, there's a monkey in the background there. Tree board. Whoa, Nelly. The spirit binding must be messing with my head. Hello, Guybrush. What? You can do that too? I'm sorry, but I must still conceal my whereabouts and communicate through the vessels of nature's works. You picked okay. a dead seagull? A perfect <laughs> place to go unnoticed. I can't help but think the advantages of flight could be more useful. Um... Yeah, I need to deal with those so I need to shrink the sponge. I have the feast of the senses, but I don't want to make it any bigger. The opposite, in fact. I'm sorry. I didn't take Voodoo Spell Reversals 201 at Hexer's Community College. Well then, Guybrush. Yes? Ask around. Ask around? Lechuck is, is pretty angry Ever with since you. Since Lechuck got a hold of your diary, he's really had it in for you. The Dread Pirate Lechuck is not one for nuances. You know this, Guybrush. Back on Flotsam, though, he seemed pretty convinced you were evil. What else happened back on Flotsam? Did he not slaughter you and your friend Morgan Le Flay in cold blood? Lechuck is mad as usual. I do not blame him for his anger towards me, or towards you. It is expected and beyond his control. You're saying Lechuck is just being Lechuck? Yep. Yes. Um, okay. She said ask around. Yeah, Elaine is a demon bride. Sure you've heard by now, but Elaine is a demon bride of LeChuck. Your wife's ways are her own. Her fate compelled by unknown forces. Yeah, she's a bit of a loose cannon. For once, I agree with you, Treepwood. Aside from joining my arch enemy, I generally appreciate the sense. Be careful, Guybrush. You must make your own choices, for Elaine does not trust in the ways of voodoo. Well, this voodoo's Your done a number on me. Voodoo have really done a number on me lately. The ebb and flow of the tides of our suffering cannot be controlled. Why are you doing this to me? What did I do to chap your hide? I am not your enemy, Treepwood. In fact, I have most likely saved you from yourself. Right. Tell that to my shambling mess of a body here. Alright. Alright, I can't keep wasting time. Lane isn't getting any less demonic. The sponge, Guybrush. If you can find a way to return it to its small, immature state, LeChuck's hold on Elaine will be lifted. Yeah. Well, that's about all the dead waterfowl combo I can handle. As you wish. Yeah. Look. Alright. Let's see what else is here. Can we go through Flotsam? Literally nothing. Literally. Oh, what's this? There's a chest. Oh, we get to unlock oh, it again? Surprise. It's locked. What a surprise! We've got a hook. I really hope those monkeys aren't reporting back Looks to LeChuck like what I'm their doing. Way to a LeChuck dress-up contest. Treepwood. Yeah. Stop doing that. In there, you will find some of the things that allowed LeChuck to get so close to your beloved Elaine. What? I don't think I want to look in there anymore. LeChuck's human form was most impressive. But we can all use the help of voodoo from time to time. I think I'm set in the voodoo department. 
If it's trust you seek, LeChuck's belt should do nicely. Don't you find it strange that LeChuck left this stuff out here in the open? I think he'd want to get rid of it. LeChuck is careless. The dead bird is not helping me trust her more. Right? Okay, so I've got the belt buckle for what that's going to do me. Uh, monkey. Huh. Another hypnotized monkey. Alright, looks like that's all we can do here is talk to the voodoo lady, look at the monkey, and get this belt buckle. Alright, so I'm thinking we have to do it instead of a feast. An anti-feast. Nice treasure pile. It is. And you'd do well to keep your scurvy little fingers off of it. I wonder if I can bury this and make him dig it up. It is gold, after all. That doesn't need to be charmed. Oh, it's a charm. Well, then what the heck am I supposed to do with it? Um... Crossroad Center will take you back to the Chuck. Gateway takes me to Winslow's Raft, but I guess that's not there anymore because he's now battling the Chuck, right? Unless I can still get just the Raft. I wonder if he knows. He knows stuff about spells, right? Caleb! Hi, Caleb. Oh, hello again. Alright, um... Oh, can you help me can reverse, you help this, me reverse spell? this spell? You said you were a connoisseur of the occult, right? Beast of the senses. Trying to watch your figure, eh, Porky? What? Hey. No, it's not for me, obviously. It's for... Don't worry, carnivorous wood. Oh, come on. That doesn't even sound like three foot. Losing weight is easy if you follow a strict diet. Here, try this. Oh, I cool. don't need a diet. I... Never mind. Hmm. Diet of the senses. Like a sponge, you are bloated in your hips and thighs. Block out the sight with a cover for your eyes. Blindfold. The smallest mouth snacks on a tiny whispered word. A sound so petite it is barely heard. A light touch for an appetizer. Stay true and thrive. A delicate feather plucked from a bird half alive. Your sixth sense is bloated with fates not yet dealt. You'll find that a secret will help tighten your belt. Fight the smell of the after-dinner treat. Eliminate odor and the urge to eat. To keep off the weight, you need food with no flavor. Find a taste so bland there's nothing to savor. Okay. So, there's a blindfold in Club 41 for the site. Sound, I think, because he mentioned that the pyrite parrots whispered. And that's the key here. So, sound is the pyrite parrots. A light touch for an appetizer to stay true and thrive. A delicate feather plucked from a bird half alive. There is a half-dead seagull that we know where it is. Your sixth sense is bloated with fates not yet dealt. You'll find a secret to help tighten your belt. I'm not sure what that is. Um, fight the smell of the afternoon treat. Eliminate odor and the urge to eat. I, I don't know. And I think we need to get some of that bland gum from the... Um, from the jail. Did we, ha did we get some already? Because we ate a wad of gum. Nope. Okay. Alright. Nope. That's not what I wanted to do. So... Well, let's go back, since we're over here, let's go check and see if we can still get to the raft. Rip. Nope, good, the raft's still here, but Winslow obviously is not. Old brute. Oh, it's deodorant for the smell, okay. The pirate alternative to bathing. This might help stave off that fresh corpse smell oh. I'm starting to notice. Gross. Alright, so the locket's gone. Okay. I guess we don't need the locket anymore because I've already reunited Whoa. with my body. Alright, so we've got the diet of the senses. We've got most of the ingredients. We need to go get a couple more. Uh, the blindfolds in Club 41, which is in the sword fighty area. So we'll head there. Club 41. So we get this bandana, this head, uh, blindfold. Bandana. <sighs> Rip. I'm 
wondering if it's like he makes those oof noises when he comes through as a corpse because it's hard for him to come through as a as a corpse instead of as a spirit. Blindfolds. How Give come me. there's only one of these? I thought all probationary members had to wear blindfolds. Probationary members? There are no probationary members here. Uh. But your bouncer said. Oh, that rock rib! Always good for a laugh. All right. Um. Let's see if we can get thrown in jail again. Hey, WP. Hold on a tick. I've almost got my stroke back. Um. I surrender. Take me to jail. I surrender. Take me to jail. For what? For kidnapping my own body. Good enough. Ne Let's go. All right. So we got this really bland gum. It tastes so bland. There is there we nothing go. to savor. This ABC gum should fit the bill. All right. So now. Hmm. I guess I'll head back to the bar. Yeah, it's kind of limiting as where we can go. Thanks. Did I come out I in the bathroom? Only slightly worse for wear, considering. That's gross. All right, what's this? Oh, it's just the wax. All right, so we've got two of the ingredients. Um, let's look here and figure out what we need to do next time. Mm. Diet of the senses. Diet of the senses. We got the blindfold. We get need to get the pirate, the, the parrot somehow. Uh, we need catch. Oh, the fishnet! We need to go get the fishnet, and then we can catch the birds in the fishnet. A light touch for an appetizer. So we need to go get a feather from the voodoo lady's seagull corpse thing. Six cents. Um, not sure what that is. Fight the smell of the after treat. Eliminate odor and urge to eat. That's the deodorant, and then the gum. So we've got almost everything for the diet of the senses. Uh, that is still the wrong button. I don't know what my problem is. And we will probably uh, go ahead and collect the last couple ingredients next time. We've got the gum. We got the blindfold, we got the deodorant. That is definitely not going to do. Um, and they've started up the lawnmowers outside, so this is the perfect time to stop so you don't have to hear them. But until next time, have a great one, and we'll leave Gabber Sleepwood here in Club 41. See you then. Arr, does it look like I'm mocking you? I'm Big Bad Bug-Eye. I keep a girly diary. I wish I had hair so I could put it up in curls. <laughs>